afternoon, everyone. How is everyone doing? Doing great? I ho I'm glad you are, because we have our second 1.18 snapshot for the Caves and Cliffs update. The second part coming later this holiday. And what do we have? Oh, well. It's just a bunch of tweaks and pretty straightforward features and everything. But you don't seem to understand some simulation distance change. I have no I don't know anything about. I have ender meaning strongholds have been added back into the game. We'll get to that in a bit. Compass for I'm not sure. I don't remember. I'll put a little errors note up on the top left. I'm not sure if I'm going to do that. And some copper and lapis changes in ore distribution. And uh, sprinting. So, if you are unaware, we went through the first experimental snapshot. We didn't want to go through the rest of them. And, uh, yeah. Let's just jump into it, shall we? So, this morning, I was waiting on Max Stuff's live stream. Go subscribe to him. He just reached, one minute, <laughs> this live 40,000 subscribers just now, just recently. And we have a, and we have, and the snapshot released. Uh, sorry, I have autism. It's true. I'll put a little image in front of you so that you can understand what it is. So, let's get to the important stuff. So, what have they fixed in this snapshot? I can't, ex I don't want to explain all the bugs, they're pretty straightforward. But, this one is important. You see, back in 21W37A, I didn't know this, but strongholds did not generate properly. They didn't generate, so they had to add, quote-unquote, add them back to the game. So, they are back. So, locate. Locate. One minute. Uh... It is now possible to speedrun Minecraft again. Locate. Stronghold. Not strong, strong jolt. Not storm jolt.
hold on. I just need the game to load first. Though there are some known issues in this update, I was thinking of putting subtitles and not talk at all. Though there are some known issues in this update, in this snapshot, you can't load old worlds. They're current. So, where's the stronghold for? We're not trying to beat the game here. I hear silverfish. I hear... I hear it. But we are in the stronghold, so they've fixed this bug. We could not beat Minecraft without this. So strongholds have been... Oh, wait. I need the game to render first. Oh, okay, there we go. But strongholds have been added back into the game, and... Uh, We've, they've also improved performance, seemingly. So huge performance upgrade. Shout out to the devs. Huge shout out. Uh, there are some sprinting changes. I'll get to that in in a moment. So, in oh, I need to get a torch, oh, torch, torch, torch. So, when slowly going close to the edge, it will no longer do that unless it's a sharp edge, sharper angle. Um, just a second. The game still needs to render. Uh, whoa. Well. Oh, I hear lava. I'm not trying to beat the game here, everyone. There's the portal. Oh, uh, that fell in lava. Okay, there we go. Well, as you can see, the end portal has been added back into the game. This was a bug. This was considered unintended. So, boop, 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 and jump in. And I'll jump in. <laughs> Need a little moment to for the game to render. The end. Crystal's pillars have been fixed too, as seen in the last snapshot. But I didn't really cover that. So I had no much, not much time to cover on that. So I need the game to render first. Let me have a moment. Uh. And, uh. There we go. And climb up to the top and. As you can see, we're in the end. And let's quickly uh, kill a type ender dragon. Boop. Everything. Okay, back. Pillars are back. Generate again. Didn't really have time to cut. There may be more on the list. into that in the mint. Whoop! Alright, so, sprinting's been changed in this snapshot. Pretty straightforward. Known issues in this snapshot. Yep, sounds pretty straightforward as well. Mm, or distribution changes. 
Well, first, we must go through simulation distance. This will s show you the distance of whether mobs are moving or not. Oh, hold on. I just need game to render first. Uh, there we go. I just need to fly. Whether how far they are, they can move, I think. It's not, it's kind of similar to entity distance. But I'm not sure what this thing really does at the moment. Uh, yeah, I don't really know what it does. So, that. Now, let's move on to diagnostic tracking. This was a feature back in 2018. Also, I don't really remember compasses being... This was a feature back in 20... Until back before 2018. And this helped players at Minecraft a lot. It tracks diagnostics. It tracks your diagnostics or something. I'm not so sure. I don't know how any of this works. I'm not a... Not much of a Minecraft expert. I know much about Minecraft, but not, not really the expert. But I am an enthusiast. I am covering it. So, these two, pretty straightforward. Potion, pretty straightforward. Let's move on to Copper Ore. And Lapis. So, Lapis will now spawn as blobs instead of being spread out from each other instead of being spread out from each other so that's point that's useful very useful so let's go all the way down to like y96 yes we're at like on a meadow on a mountain so if you're unaware of this update of this snapshot exactly I suggest you go check out one of my previous videos I'll put a card in the top right corner if I can but copper will spawn at like its limit will spawn at Y95 now as intended so you may you may first see you may last see copper at like y95 to y0. Hmm, that's also pretty straightforward. So, were those all the features? I guess so. So, if you enjoyed this video, be sure to like and subscribe and uh Share this video with your friends and uh, definitely leave a comment down below of what you think of this video, though it is a little laggy right now. And as always, I will see you in the next one. Bye-bye.